Hello everyone, welcome, welcome, welcome to I Am the Fifth Element. My name is Juan and I'm here to do an energy read for today, which is April 15th, 2021. All right, guys, first let's start with prayer. Heavenly Father, Holy Spirit, angels of the highest love and light, you are welcome here. Please fill this space. I'm here to do an energy read for Fifth Element as a collective for today, April 15th, 2021. Please give us a clear and concise message. You know how I read. Thank you. All right, guys, it's been a while. I plan to get back to our daily energy reads. The energies these days are really, really, really heavy. And when we're in taking energy, even as light workers or spiritualists or alchemists, you are still working with these energies as they inc as they come in. And until you get acclimated to the energies, you can't really assist others, okay? So, I have been getting acclimated myself with these huge, ginormous energies that are rolling in. So, today's message, and I have lots of messages on ready uh, to go, but I don't release them until my team tells me, okay? So, today's message was recorded or downloaded on February 20th, 2021 at 8.27 in the evening, 8.27 in the evening, okay? So the title is Perfect Package. So 220, 2021 was a nine day. Nines are all about growth and expansion. Today is a six day. Sixes are about harmony or the journey too. So journeying you to harmony through growth and expansion. This is the gist of this message today. So the title, Perfect Package, and it comes from a cardinal alarm. So cardinals represent devotion, monogamy, family, good luck, good fortune, 12 hours, 12 days, midnight or noon. After sighting the bird, there's going to be some sort of serendipitous or auspicious happening, okay? Now, notice that 827 p.m. is after the sun has gone down. So this would be a nocturnal bird song. So nocturnal bird songs are urgent or important, let's say, important downloads. Now, what I have not shared ever, I believe, is that when birds bring downloads, I can physically see uh, these disc-like translucent uh, energies that come and deposit into my being, your being. So birds literally bring messages. You may not see it, uh, physically, or sense it even, depending on how tapped in to you that you are, but they do. So the cardinal alarm, alarm sound for many reasons in life and with the cardinal. So after sitting with it, this was an alarm about bringing something to, something to one's attention. So this perfect package that my team talks about is um, divining. There is no perfect package for divining. It's going to be unique to you, okay? So if you are judging someone else in the way that they divine and you think that you can't do the job and you're called to do the job, this message is for you. Because we have to be clear about how I get my downloads. They do not come in perfect little packages initially. When they come to you, they may seem like they're in this perfect format that tells what's going on. But they do not come into my spirit or my being that way. It takes sifting to get there. Now, when you divine, sometimes the downloads are all one huge epiphany in one chunk. Sometimes they're small, digestible chunks. Sometimes they break this information under a slow reveal over days, hours, weeks, months, sometimes years, depending on how, depending on how heavy the energy is. 
So, years ago, I set an intention with my team for them to do the filing system on these downloads because from day to day, I could be in charge or of or have 30 different things floating in the ethers that I'm responsible for keeping track of or delivering a message to. So I said the intention years ago that they do my filing. So it's something that's done subconsciously. So when I get an additional piece to a puzzle or a download, there is a zing in my being to let me know, hey, this belongs here. And I'm um, even got it to um, where to link the pieces, okay? I have been divining since I was 19 years old and I'm 50. So it's something that has taken time. So please do not judge someone else's way of divining and feel um, inadequate. So, for those who look at your abilities as small or insignificant, they are not. To grow your abilities, incorporate your interests. What are you naturally drawn to? What calls to your spirit? What makes you happy simply doing? Bring your uniqueness to play. You are to listen inwardly and outwardly for synchronistic guidance. So that's what I talked about. They are literally, they come in synchronistic chunks. And your guides, your body, your um, abilities will tell you where these pieces belong. So we have double eight energy in this download. So eight, eight energy is about a higher calling. That's grounded in self-awareness, so knowing who you are, knowing yourself fully, and reverence for all life. There is also 555 energy attached, because if you look at today's date, it is 4-15-2021. So 4 and 1 is 5, then we have our 5, and then we have 2021, which is a year of change. So 555 energy. So when I see 555 energy, it's not a woe is me. 555 energy just means you can expect the unexpected. And what I feel is something serendipitous, something auspicious. And as I arrive at that, my crown opened up completely. So. Concentration then on the time that the download was received, 827. So 827 feels like 89, as in steps of progression along your God journey. And you are right at this 89 phase. So 8 is about movement and abundance, and 9s are about growth and expansion. So movement and abundance in a phase of growth and expansion. This is huge, heavy energy and if you could master using as much as this of this energy to your highest good you could grow leaps and bounds spiritually and tangibly right now so i feel like you're on steps eight of eight and nine of a project or a phase this feels like completely completing a lifelong passion or bringing long-held works into fruition, making them tangible, making them re real. As I arrived at that, the morning dove coos. So the morning dove coos as a divine messenger. Angel number 827 as an angel number. I just wrote a few things down and it'll be linked in the description box or put in the description box. Listen to your intuition about the next steps along your spiritual path. Maintain a positive attitude. Expect positive abundance, well-earned reward. So positive abundance is whatever you consider valuable. So abundance is just not money. And I was just shown 1101 coding. So that reminds me of binary coding. And it also gives me a feeling of multiple new beginnings, all in God's source, all in leap of faith energy. So expect positive abundance, well-earned rewards. You are well blessed by the angelic realm. And as I come to that, 
the tough tip mouse sings. Now the tough tip mouse has a very distinctive song. It sounds like a whistle. So when I sit with the whistling tough tough tip mouse, what I feel is that there is a promise of the future windfall energy, high spiritual ranking and regard. And as I get to high spiritual ranking and regard, the morning dove coos again, who we now know is a divine messenger from discussing it earlier. So this is for someone who is sitting on their gifts. You are a divine messenger. This cardinal came to bring this to your attention. It is time to get to work, to do your work, to bring your uniqueness to play. This is our message for today, beautiful people. Please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Also, check out the description box below. You'll find additional helpful information about this read, angel numbers, numerology, additional insight. Until next time, I'm wishing you miracles and blessings. Namaste.